Part of my upbringing, I was born on the southwest side, uh, Chicago, and grew up in Little Village. I kind of was there kind of most of my childhood life and uh, moved on to the West Lawn area, but I always came back every day to Little Village just to hang out with my friends and being at Petrowski Park. When I first learned about finance, it was my senior year of high school. And I had my whole life planned out. I was gonna go to U of I, become an architect. One of my uh, high school teachers, Mr. Artis, uh, asked me to take his econ class. And I told him, I was like, Mr. Artis, I'm gonna be an architect, I'm going to U of I. He's like, I'm okay, I'm set. And you know, he kindly put me in a headlock and said, Martin, I want you to take my econ class. I was like, okay, Mr. Artis. And he knew I loved sports. So he's like, it's gonna be competitive. You're really gonna enjoy it. And so I took the econ class and so we we're given $100,000 in simulation money and we we're asked to research companies and to invest it and try to get the best returns possible. We did the best we could as kids from the neighborhood and we didn't know much. We we're a bunch of poor Latino kids from Little Village and going to Bogan High School. And so everything he taught us in research, we tried to put that into practice. And I ended up changing my major to finance and changing the university to Northern Illinois University. Cabrera Capital Markets, when we first started, it was three employees. And this is in 2001. And we grew and we've had some tough times as well, kind of ups and downs, just like in the market. And uh, last year was our best year ever. We underwrote about $280 billion worth of bond transactions for corporations, municipalities, and some equity IPOs. As I started the business, a big part of what I did was to give back to community organizations, but also to students that were like me, that, that were broke as the Ten Commandments. They didn't have any money to go to school, but they had a passion, desire, and we wanted to make a difference for them. So a big part of what we do is financial literacy, but also helping other non-for-profits here in Chicago, but also around the country. And that's been embedded in, in who we are, what we do as a company. But it's extremely important to us and that we know that we can do well financially, but also do good and make a difference in our communities. And it goes back to my parents. My mother was always involved in the schools that I was at when I was a kid. My father was a community activist, always giving back to the community and helping other families. I talk about it a lot is that we have to be unapologetic as Latinos, that we need to go out there and create wealth and not create wealth just to have wealth, but to share within our community, to give back civically. That makes you who you are and makes you passionate and makes you want to drive to be the best. And that's great because I couldn't have done it by myself or on my own.